afternoon. I have just spent the whole morning helping my kids with their homeschool work. It is now just five minutes past 12, so just the afternoon. And I am going to spend some time in my studio with this pattern here, <laughs> the Lichen Duster. Lichen, Lichen, Lichen. The Lichen Duster. Which it says it um, can be a dress, but I'm going to make it as a jacket. So I'm looking forward to chipping away at it a little bit. And then I need to package up some orders. So that will be my afternoon. I have taken out a pasta sauce that I made quite a few months ago that was in our deep freezer. I have lots and lots of meals in there so I'm planning on using them this week seeing as though I haven't done um, a vegetable and fruit shop in some time and I like to go to this one place in town and it only opens Thursdays, Fridays, Saturdays so I'm hoping to get there one of those days this week and stock up on a few items that we just don't have in the garden at the moment. I'm down to the last two homegrown onions so it'll be nice to get some more onions however there are so many leeks out in the garden I'm thinking of just purposefully not purchasing um, onions for a while so I can use up the leeks that are in the garden because it's basically sort of the same thing really isn't it? <laughs> so it will be a pretty quiet day today just chipping away in here and then um, my kids are doing top secret birthday things so I'm not allowed to go into the lounge room and kitchen at the moment because they are making things for me um, which is lovely. So yeah I've made myself a cup of tea and I have a warm glass of water and I am going to get cracking on this pattern. I almost forgot to mention that I am wearing my Felix cardigan and my Mika shawl today with a store purchased top and pants. cutting out this pattern I have measured myself and figured out what size I need to make I'm hoping it's not going to be too big because when I originally measured myself for another um, so liberated pattern the hinterland dress it was two times too big and I had to go from the size that I'd measured myself down to the size that I've now made loads of dresses out of so I'm gonna give it a go I might make it in a muslin first or a cheaper fabric that I have maybe a um I might make it in a sheet that I uh, an old sheet that I have yeah I think I'll do that so and then I'll cut into my beautiful linen fabric after when I've perfected it it's also going to take me a long time to figure this all out because <laughs> I don't know about you guys but knitting patterns for me are in my language and I know how to read a knitting pattern inside out but a sewing pattern it just it's just taking me longer because it's not something that I've done for a long time so it might it might take me <laughs> a while here I am thinking it's just going to be really simple but it's not. Um, I've packaged up all the orders that I'm posting off um, this afternoon. I need to take my daughter to an appointment so I'm going to go and do that now and then get home and cook up 
the pasta sauce that I got out of the freezer with some pasta. Easy dinner. Yeah, so I might film a little bit of the evening activities and I might read through the instructions for the jacket again just to completely understand at least the first few steps so that's what I will do this evening I probably will show a little bit of footage but I won't chat so I'm gonna say good night now and I'll see you tomorrow for little snippets of my birthday but I probably won't be talking as much. I'll be enjoying my day with my family.